Shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakaha Kadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth, to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men. Peace, blessings, salutations to the remnant men, women, children, shalom, right? So this your brother Shapai, man. Salaki about my voice. It's shaking. Excuse me, Salaki. So here we is, man, with stuff going on in the world. And this comes out about Dwayne Wade yesterday pressuring his his son to, you know. To to in <laughs> a <to> transform, <laughs> you know. Ex-wife Dwayne Wade's ex-wife accused the former NBA star of exploiting their trans daughter Zaya's gender identity for his own financial gain. Yeah, cause when he finished playing ball, he was doing a little basket, doing a tour, and instead of the ex NBA player. Focusing on basketball, playing with LeBron and Shaq and stuff like that. He talking. He was mostly talking about his transgender daughter. That's all, his son. That's all he was talking about. So Savannah Fonchway objected to her ex-husband's petition to change, legally change the 15-year-old's name, due to multiple factors outlined in court documents. One of them was, I know it said that, let me see, it says he he was trying to, he was actually, oh yeah, here you go. It's like, the author, 41, alleges that Wade, 40, is positioning to profit from the minor child's name and gender change with various companies through contracts <clears throat> and marketing opportunities, including but not limited to deals with Disney. So he's making money off of, like I said, he going around doing these tours and he pushing that on that vibration on the kid. She adds, I have concerns that we may be pressuring our child to move forward with the name and gender change in order to capitalize on the financial opportunities that he has received. Yeah, he's a weirdo, man. He's a weirdo. He's a weirdo. Some I never really liked this guy anyway. Something about him always was off to me. Claims during an April 20, April 2022 meeting that Wade, meeting with Wade in Atlanta, the former pole ball baller told her that a lot of money had been made already in relation to Zaya's name and gender issue. Wade told me that he intended to make our child famous due to the name and gender issue and also informed me that there would be endorsement contracts associated there with the public speaker the public speaker alleges yeah then uses her trans daughter dead, dead name in the filing claiming zion who is was present at the time answered that various companies were interested in that Disney was a prospective come date, man. This man, this place, man. This place, man. So you got that. You got. I just wanna. I wanna give you the contrast. The contrast between D Wade and the and, and what he's doing and the love he's doing and then what Kyrie is doing. Kyrie Irving. Kyrie Irving out here. He just trying to find what's going on according to the scriptures. Who he is in the scriptures. Or who he is and he's searching. You know what I'm saying? So 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 yeah, so let's get a let's see who's wrong who's wrong and right according to the scripture. Let's let's get some scriptures. See who who's 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 doing the best job, the better job rather, according to the scripture. Let's start with Deuteronomy. And Deuteronomy is second book of the law. Let's start there. This ain't going, this, I just wanted, you know, just it was on me all day yesterday, like, damn. Dwayne Wade doing what he doing, and he's celebrated. He's on TV, everybody's, you know, applauded him and how strong he is. But Kyrie Irving is a demon. 
according to the media right now. Deuteronomy chapter 23 and 17. There shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel, nor a sodomite of the sons of Israel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's get this one. Let's get Leviticus. Let's get Leviticus, book of law. 1822 Thou shalt not lie with mankind as with woman womankind. It is an abomination. Man. Let's get, get a couple more. <laughs> let's get a couple let's get a couple more on Dwayne Wade is not not going with the scriptures. What he doing out here is not going with the scriptures. Let's get first Kings 14. And 24, 1 Kings 14 and 24. And there were also Sodomites in the land, and they did according to all the abominations of the nations which the Lord cast out before the children of Israel. Yeah. So we, nothing new under the sun. This is what we was doing. This is what we always was doing. Psalms 106 and 34. We, we get around these other nations and Psalms 106 to 34. They did not destroy the nations concerning whom the Lord commanded them, but were mingled among the heathen and learned their works. Yeah, mingled among the heathen and learned their works, man. First Timothy. First Timothy 1 and 10. Knowing, nah, knowing this, knowing this, that the law is not made for the righteous, for a righteous man, but for the lawless and the disobedient, for the ungodly and for the sinners, for the unholy and profane, for the murderers of fathers and murderers of mothers, for manslayers, for whoremongers, for them that defile themselves with mankind, for men stealers, for liars, for perjured persons, and if there be any other thing that is contrary to sound doctrine. Yeah, this what Dwayne Wade is talking about is contrary to sound doctrine. Now, let's give you a couple of little things over here. You know, to kind of back up, you know, Kyrie, they, they go, oh, you guys are anti, anti this and anti that or whatever the case may be. But it's, it's plenty of proof out there. There's plenty of proof out there about as far as um the ish people. You know what I'm saying? The ish people. Look at this one. Look at this one. At the height at the height of US slavery, 78% of slave owners were Jewish. Do you see this? <laughs> Do you see this? At the height of U.S. slavery, 78% of slave owners were Jewish. Since only 1.6 of the total population owned slaves, and Jews made up 3.125% of the population, this means that 40% of Jews owned slaves, while only 0.035% of whites owned slaves. You see this? Jewish slave owners. Mm. Get another one. Jewish Jewish slave ship owners. Jewish slave ship owners. I mean, the history is right there, man. The history is there. There's another thing. They 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 saying that with. As far as Jew, Jew where it's at right here, in pre-Civil War United States, 2% of white Gentile households own slaves. 40% of Jewish household owners own, um, households own slaves. Jews were 2,000% more likely to own, a, own slaves than white Gentiles because they had more money. They had more money from banking. The bank, they 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 just all in the banking, supporting wars, and doing this and doing that. They, that's 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 what they was doing. 
Who do the curses fit though? Who, who, who do the curses fit? So whether whether you say you believe it or not, you can't tell. You can't say that a person is crazy if they believe it. It's so much proof out okay. here. So they going around, they demonizing Kyrie Irving and this and this and that. For sure, it don't say in the scriptures that I, it, it says I will sing. Matter of fact, let's get it. Let's get it. You going in the chains with your enemies. It don't say your brother going, I'm going to take you into Egypt again with your brother. <laughs> let's go to Deuteronomy 28. 28 and 25. Let's start there, I think. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Deuteronomy 28 and 25. The Lord shall cause thee to be smitten before thine enemies. No, your brother. Before thine enemies, thou shalt go out one, one way against them and flee seven ways before them and shall be removed unto all the kingdoms of the earth. We was removed from over there to over here at the hands of our enemy and clearly we see who provided the transportation for us to come here and <laughs> who owned us while we was here so again you know you they, they try to demonize Kyrie but I mean it's proof out there to back up the movie you know what I'm saying and, and him feeling saying that that kind of we are the people of the scriptures whether you believe it or not, it's proof out there that backs it up. Whether you believe that proof or not. 47, let's go down to 47. Thirty-two. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given into another, unto another people, the same people, unto another people, and thy eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, and there shall be no might in thy hand. Yeah. <laughs> Forty-five. Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee, and shall pursue thee. And overtake thee till thou be destroyed, because thou hearkenest not unto the voice of the Lord thy power to keep his commandments and his statutes which commanded thee, like the way Wade is going against right now. And they shall be upon thee for a sign, and they shall be upon thee for a sign and for a wonder, and upon thy seed forever. Oh no, just a couple of years. Like the cost situation that they went through. Ten years it was over. We went through we went through slavery, Jim Crow, civil rights ever, and at the end of it, we still fucked up. Because thou servest not the Lord thy power with joyfulness and with gladness of heart for the abundance of all things. Here's the point. Now watch this. 48. Therefore shalt thy serve thine enemies. Our brothers, therefore shalt thy serve thine enemies, which the Lord shall send against thee in hunger and in thirst and in nakedness and in want of all things. And he shall put a yoke of iron and he shall put a yoke of iron <laughs> upon thy neck until until he have destroyed thee. Yeah. He shall put a yoke of iron upon thy neck. So again, so they out here they saying um Kyrie Irving is 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 anti anti this, anti that, and this and that. But it's it's history, it's historical facts. It's facts out there to back up him feeling that way. But he's He's somebody to be attacked and demonized in this situation, in, in this world. And Dwayne Wade is chilling. They even come out the next day. They do that that day. And then look, so they come out today. And so now they got this today. 
They got this one today. Dwayne Wade fires back at mother of his um, transgender daughter over lawsuits seeking to prevent gender challenge. So he trying to call her unfit mother. He's called, she's an unfit mother. The mother is trying to keep her son a son. The father is trying to promote his, his son turning into a girl. And so the mother is going to be demonized because he got the money, he got the fame, he got this society behind him. And so the mother is going to have a hard fight on her hands. The mother going to have a hard fight on her hands. This is, this is a crazy place we in, man. This is a crazy place we in, man. This is a crazy place we in, man. Let's go, um... Joshua 23 and 15. Yeah. It's a place, crazy place, crazy place. It's a crazy place we in, man. Crazy. Joshua 20, 23 and 15. Therefore, it shall come to pass that all as good things are come upon you, which the Lord your power promised you, so shall the Lord bring upon you all evil things, until he have destroyed you from off the good land which the Lord your power have given you. So again, the Lord said he going to destroy us off the land. Dumb people back on the land chilling good money in good case. So how are they the people? How are they, how are they the people of the, of the scriptures, man? When ye have transgressed the covenant of the Lord your power, which he commanded you, and have gone and served other gods, and bowed yourself to them, then shall the anger of the Lord be kindled against you, and ye shall perish quickly from off the good land, the land that they have in Sanator, from off the good land which he have given unto you. Ah. They're not the people of the Bible. The Bible backs this up. Plain as day, the Bible backs this up. Jeremiah 12 and... Seven. I have forsaken mine house. I have left mine heritage. I have given the dearly beloved of my soul into the hand of her enemies. Eh. The curses do not fit. The, the scriptures do not fit them. Jeremiah 12 and 7. I have forsaken my house. I have left my heritage. I have given the dearly beloved of my soul into the hand of her enemies. My heritage is unto me as a lion in the forest. It crieth out against me, therefore have I hated it. My heritage is unto me as a speckled bird. The birds round about are against her. Come ye assemble all the beasts of the field, come ye to devour. Speckled bird, they saying that's just, they, let them tell it, that's just all one bird over there. Where's the speckledness at? <laughs> over there in, in, in the land right now. Where's the speckledness? Man, the scriptures do not fit these people, man. I'm, I'm done with this, man. I just wanted to show that somebody is living according to the scriptures or living more closer to the scriptures. Dwayne Wade is not living nowhere near the scriptures, but he's celebrated in this society. He's celebrated. This society got, got his back. The mother come out and say what she say the next day. You can find about eight, nine different articles. You know what I'm saying? Um, with Dwayne Wade firing back at his um, ex-wife for wanting to keep her son a son. <laughs> that just sound crazy, man. But again, man, who does the curses fit, man? Who does the curses fit? It don't fit them people, man. Whether you... you Mad that we saying it or not, it's the truth. So with that one, we gonna close out all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukhahakwadash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David. 
144,000 mighty men. Peace, blessings, salutations to the remnant, men, women, children. Remain spiritual out there. Kwam Yasharala. And a bye, bye, bye. Rock a thumb, family. Shalom.